And barely two weeks to Christmas, the prices of goats in the popular Swali market in Bayelsa State Capital, Yanagua, has increased. Now, residents in Yanagua Metropolis blame the traders for the increase in the prices of goats and other commodities. Trust TV's Friday, a Bimo Boy Peter visited some spots in the city where goats are sold to ascertain their prices this festive season. Here's his report. Resident Bobby Ugo and Tona Timimbi, who bought a gold and rice at exorbitant rates, call on federal government to set up a tax force to control the market prices. One thing about Nigeria is uh, they don't obey the, the laws of gravity. What goes up will surely come down. So um, prices are high. The woman that goes to farm in Bayasa here, for food that used to satisfy me, Today now, that fufu, the fufu cannot satisfy me. Will you blame Tinimbo? Will you blame the Yedri? Will you blame the government for that? No. The gari that uh, we, our people see it as a normal thing. The prices are high. Everybody will just tag it as uh, things are high now. So let me eye my food stock also. Government should try and come into this price control. There should be tax fraud. When the government pronounce that, tax fraud should follow up to ensure that the prices are people carry out the the orders of the government. Buy the, my, the, when I went to buy goods, you know, the good sellers told me that it's because of the cost of fuel and uh, the cost of transportation and other things, and they are uh, higher in dollar. That is the reason why the good is so expensive. But I have no option because you know we are in the festive season and I need goods, so I have no option than to buy. So. I'm using this medium to call on the federal government to look into the price of goods and uh, other commodities. A gold seller simply identified as Zico said they are not responsible for the increase in the prices of gold. He attributed the increase to the hike in fuel price and the increase in dollar price. The one who said 50, don't go 60. The one who goes 60, don't go 70. Because the change of money, the dollar is not high. First, it don't high. Now, what would they go in Niger? Would they go buy good for Niger? So, what would they go in Niger now? The price don't go it don't high because the disaster money don't high pass for all. So, what would go in Nigeria? The thing don't go a place for us. And the transport, before, from now, would they go north? 10,000, 8,000. But now, what would they go north? 30,000, now you can leave going north. What lay you? I want to make the federal government make it look this matter, make it list something for four side. Then the dollar make it try to talk to these people there, make it reduce the dollar price. If we do all like that, by God's grace, we save Nigeria money with the ice more. This festive season, some goods are sold for as high as seventy-five thousand naira and more. From Yenagua, Friday, Ebimobowi, Peter, Trust TV News, Yenagua.